Hello everyone and welcome to the 50,000 subscriber Q&A special. Today I'm going to be answering some of your questions and I'm also going to be drawing some of your avatars while answering questions just to make the video more interesting. Let's get right into it. So the first question is from at 9000 and they ask, what was your main inspiration when making storytime animation videos? When I was younger, I would watch a lot of storytime animators such as The Odd Ones Out, Jaden Animation, Something Else YT. I really loved storytime animators growing up and I still do. And I guess a part of me just kind of always wanted to be a storytime animator. So I guess I'm kind of that now. The next question is from lovegirl5 and they ask, what drawing app do you use and since when did you start drawing and what encouraged you to start digital art? The drawing app I use is IBS Paint X. Uh, I started digital art I think around third grade? I'm not entirely sure. I was young when I started. One of my friends was drawing on IBS Paint X and I was like, hey, what's what's the what are you, what are you doing over there? And they said, oh, this is IBS Paint X. You should totally download it. So I did. And then I started drawing and now we're here. <laughs> All right, this next question is from Red Turtle YT and they ask, what is your nationality and what got you into animation? My nationality is Indian American and uh, what got you into animation? Again, I've always watched a bunch of storytime animators growing up so I guess I just always carried that part of me and decided to try dip my feet into the animation pool. <laughs> Alright, this next question is from Purple Candy Wrapper and they ask, what do you do in your free time? My free time, I really like to draw obviously, but I also like to do piano, I do tennis sometimes, and I also play video games. This question is from Alien Freak, and they ask, Do your parents know you make YouTube vids, and if they do, do they approve of that? I hope I get into the Q&A. Well, congratulations, you are in the Q&A, and yes, my parents know I make YouTube videos. My mom was actually one of my first subscribers. JJCVR4 asks, How do you feel with yourself on YouTube throughout the time you've been here? I feel great, honestly. I never expected the channel to get this far in a million years. It's honestly insane how far we've come in just, I think, three years it's been since the channel has started. It's just crazy. I feel really great about everything that we've accomplished. What is your favorite and most awfully embarrassing memory as a kid? Oh boy, I have a lot. Um, Probably the most embarrassing one is just every time I've peed myself in preschool, kindergarten. Uh, I do have a really embarrassing one, but I'm saving that for another video, so stay tuned. Are you gonna make longer animatics? I'm, I mean, I've thought about this for a while. I think it would be cool to just make a full length story time video instead of just shorts. I do find that shorts are just easier to put out. I wanna have as much quality and quantity of content for you guys. So I find that shorts are a bit easier, but I feel like it would be nice to make longer animatics. Question, are you Australian? If so, me too. I'm not Australian, but love to all the Australians watching. All right, which app do you use? Who is your favorite singer? Who is your favorite YouTuber? And which app do you use for making animations? Okay, uh, <laughs> yeah, those first three were kind of uh, in your face, but okay, which app do I use? IBS Paint X. Who is your favorite singer? Currently, I really like Mitski and Marina. Who is your favorite YouTuber? I have a lot of favorite YouTubers, but these are my top favorites. And a small request, I would like a tutorial on how to make animations. I think I'll make a tutorial maybe in the future, probably not right now because I'm still figuring things out myself, but definitely in the future. Top three favorite ice cream flavors. All right, so my first all-time favorite is cookies and cream. Then it'll probably be butter pecan and then just plain chocolate. What do you eat for breakfast? I won't judge. It's like the most controversial question. Uh, honey bunches of oat cereal. What's your favorite movie, your favorite hobby, and are you in a relationship? I don't have a favorite movie. There's too much. My favorite hobby is drawing and no, sadly, I am not in a relationship. Single forever. What is your favorite color? This shade of red. Does this count as a question? I mean, I guess so. Can we get married? Joke, what I actually want to say. But then they never put what they actually want to say. Uh, no, we can't get married. I'm sure you're wonderful, but, uh, no. <laughs> what is your favorite anime and why? What is your favorite fictional animal? I don't watch anime. The only anime I've ever watched is a few episodes of My Hero Academia, and I didn't like it that much. Um, yeah, I don't have an answer for this. I, I just don't watch anime. My favorite fictional animal are unicorns. What is your least favorite channel? Oh, probably SS Sniper- Oh, hold on guys, I think someone's at my front door. Do you like pop, country, or rock better? Favorite Roblox game? Do you like doing art or Roblox better? My favorite genre is probably indie, but if I had to choose, I guess, pop? 
I have a lot of favorite Roblox games, but my all-time favorite is probably Flickr. I do enjoy doing art more than Roblox. Art is something I've always been passionate about, and Roblox is pretty much more of a hobby. Um, I don't see myself doing much with Roblox in my future, but I do feel like art can take me a lot of places. Angry head shouting, screaming, small head smile. I'm sure this is a reference to something, but I just don't get it. <laughs> Do you like ramen? Yes. Will you be my friend? Uh, I get this question a lot, and I'm sorry guys, but the answer is no. I love and appreciate you all so much, but at the end of the day, I don't actually know any of you, and you don't know me. We're just strangers. Why did you become a YouTuber? I became a YouTuber because of <laughs> quarantine boredom, basically. I made this channel in, I think, the peak of the COVID-19 virus, so... I, yeah, I just made it out of boredom. Um, I guess I've always had this thought in the back of my head that maybe one day I can be a YouTuber. So I guess I just made that dream come true in, during a global pandemic. Do you have a TikTok account? No, and I probably never will. It's a very toxic app. What do you love about being a YouTuber? You guys, I love interacting with you guys. I love seeing the amazing comments you guys post on the videos. Just all the support from you guys makes me so happy and motivated to keep going on this journey. Do you have any phobias? If so, what are they? I am extremely scared of insects. Any type of insect, I can't do. I will literally pass out on the spot if I see an insect. Okay, dot dot dot. What was your most popular video ever? My most popular video is the hamsters die in weird ways video. Um, that was the first video of mine to go super viral. I was genuinely shocked at how many views it got and how many new subscribers it brought in. What got you into drawing? I've been drawing for as long as I can remember. Ever since I figured out how to pick up a pencil, I've been drawing. I like to think that I've always been a very creative person and I've channeled that into drawing. I like how this person under them said, oh, good one. What's your least favorite color? This shade of yellow. It's like a yellow mixed with brown. It's just so ugly. <laughs> if you could go to any time period, which one would you go to and why? I would definitely go to some time in the future, probably the year 3000, just to see how much things have changed. Uh, I'd want to go into a history class, see if they're learning about COVID-19 and TikTok. Angry head shouting. What? Dude, why are you still here? What is this? What's your opinion on gotcha? Uh, I used to like gotcha a lot when I was younger. I don't really um, care for it now, but uh, there are a bunch of talented people in the community and it's, it's a really nice community. <laughs> um, I like it. Are you a cat or dog person? I love cats so much, but I am deathly allergic, so I'm gonna have to do go with dog person. Egg or no egg? Uh, well, obviously egg. <laughs> How long did it take you to find your art style, and how'd you find your art style? I actually really like it. First of all, aw, thank you. And second of all, I've always wanted to do kind of a more simplistic, cartoony style, and whenever I drew stick figures as a kid, this was always the kind of style I went for, so I guess I just modified it for the videos. Do you read Warrior Cats? If so, who is your favorite character? I used to really like Warrior Cats when I was younger, but I never actually read any of the books. One of my uh, close friends, they um, really liked liked warrior cats so then i really liked warrior cats um but i never actually have read any of the books but a uh, favorite character uh probably fireheart i don't know <laughs> how are you today i'm doing pretty good thank you can this be the last question yeah sure why not <coughs>